Hey guys, welcome back to our vlog channel. Today is February 6th. I know that because tomorrow's the 7th and it's the Super Bowl. Yeah. Josh is super pumped for it. Yeah, are you nervous at all? No. Right now we are on our way to meet with our officiant, which is really exciting because this is the first step of getting married. So we filled out like a whole questionnaire last night just about all the details about us and stuff like that and then we get to meet with her and talk and I think we're gonna meet with her a couple times that's how this works so we have no idea what we're doing but we're meeting her at a Starbucks I obviously won't be vlogging during it I'm sure she'd think that's weird but we're both really excited are you excited yeah. I am I'm really excited for this so we just met with our officiant and we're really excited because she's so so sweet um, Yes, she just was all about really getting to know us. We kind of told her our background while we were there and told her stories and she told us about her. It was really fun. Yeah. You really liked her? Yeah, I do. Yeah. She was, she was awesome. We both feel very comfortable with her. She's very sweet and just familiar. Like she gave, I had hugged her like four times. She just gives off that feeling of Warm love and, and love, and, yeah. That she's a genuine, caring person. She yeah. Really, yeah. So, no, so, I'm very happy with her. Yeah. She's great. We're gonna do a sand ceremony and um, a really cool ceremony. Or she was talking about like having all of our uh, attendants hold our rings and like bless them and um, a flower thing for our moms. So she's gonna write our ceremony and give it back to us, um, and we're just gonna kind of. FaceTime her a few more times before the wedding and then she'll come to the rehearsal and everything. So we're just really excited. She seems super, super sweet and really glad we found her. For some reason I was just like drawn to her. Like I saw her on Wedding Wire and I contacted a few people but like I really wanted, she was the only person I really remembered and I really wanted and I just saw her face and I was like, she just, I just like felt like a connection. So she seems really cool. So we're gonna go grab some lunch though because all I've had today is a protein bar and I'm starving so we're gonna go to Witch Witch and get they have um instead of sandwiches they have bowl witch so you can customize what's in your salad. See so it says it's normal these are the sandwich bags you fill what you want but then you pick bowl witch for a salad. Look at this guys packaged lemon juice. I've never seen that before have you? I've literally never ever seen that before. Yeah. I'm gonna add it to my water. Do you want some? I'll try it. <laughs> I'm skeptical about processed lemon juice. Josh is like one of the most picky people. He hates trying new things. And then a lot of times once I finally get him to try something, he likes it. Mm, sometimes. <laughs> I like what I like. That's it. You don't second guess? I don't second guess. <laughs> So this is our salad, so you get to pick all the ingredients. I think the avocado is extra, but um, looks real good. And then Josh got this one. You got kind of more like a chef salad. Yeah. Except for the, I guess chef salad normally have ham, but you don't like get any of the toppings? You're such a bland boy. Josh is the bland I like man. What I like. <laughs> so I just took a little rest. Um, and now we are going to sort of an or early dinner with my grandparents and my mom because we were going to go to dinner with them to celebrate my graduation last week, but my grandma wasn't feeling good, so now we're going this week. So, yes! And of course we're going to Bonefish. They love Bonefish, we love Bonefish, win-win. So, we're ended up not going to dinner. I've actually been crying. I mean, nothing bad happened, but... I am an emotional person, and I deal with all my emotions with tears, happy, sad, everything. And, um, like, I cry a lot, but it's healthy. Um, I don't cry because I'm sad a lot, but, like, literally, I'll get excited about something and start crying. Like, I'll be like, oh, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, and I'll cry. It happens all the time. <laughs> anyway, um, what happened at night was my grandma, who was supposed to meet us there, my mom called me and said... Um, Grammy can't go because she is sick and she was sick last week and so we had to cancel and she has like headaches and she has um she has Alzheimer's so going out is difficult for her I think being around people is difficult for her and I just like my mom just mentioned that you know that's what happens when people get old and I just like lost it 
because I just I've already lost a grandparent this, this summer and I know like I'm gonna lose them all eventually and it makes me really sad so oh meatball just scared me I need to just like chill out because I was just like I just totally had this like oh my god life do you ever have just times where you're like everyone dies life is so unpredictable like and it freaks you out or maybe that's just me and my anxiety but I have moments where I just can't even do it but I think I'm gonna end this vlog here but first let's well I probably actually I'll vlog tomorrow during the Super Bowl obviously um but this I got it at Bed Bath & Beyond the other night if you saw the vlog. What do you guys think about me putting it up here? Because we tried over the couch and it's too small. But we kind of have this whole like mirrored chrome kind of stuff going on. So I think this would look cool right here. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. I love re I love when I get to ask you guys a question and then you respond to it in the comments. It's like so cool. I feel like I have all these friends. <laughs> so popular am I. No, but it really is cool. Like I, I love this vlog channel. But... Yeah, and I get to like get out my feelings about stuff like this. And for some reason when I'm talking to a camera, it feels like I got it out. I don't know how to explain it. Anyway, I think I'm just gonna end this here for tonight. Josh just went to pick us up some dinner. I mean, since we didn't have anything planned because we're gonna go out, so I'll be back. Um, and I think I'm gonna, I started watching um, a movie last night. I started watching, um, train wreck with Amy Schumer and god she's fucking funny so I'm gonna finish that movie and then I think I'm gonna go to bed so that I get going at a decent time tomorrow for the Super Bowl who's excited we are so I put a fuck ton of spinach in this smoothie I've been making these like every day and so it's green but it's like there's nothing you can't even tell that spinach is in there and you can't taste it it's so good are you pumped? It's Super Bowl Sunday! I'm so pumped. Josh is cleaning because that's what he does when he's nervous. <laughs> I'm so anxious. Anxious? So yes, it is Super Bowl Sunday. We are so pumped. Josh, um, I can tell, is really like nervous. Anxious, I would say. Um, I'm just so excited. I can't believe it's actually Broncos versus Panthers because I I totally predicted this like in August. I kept saying to Josh, like, what if it's Panthers Broncos, won't that be crazy since we live in Denver? So yes, I'm very excited. My dad and um, his friend are coming over to watch it with us and we're really excited. Josh is definitely pumped. He went to the grocery store just to get a few things. Um, I wanted some spaghetti squash today. I've been like on a spaghetti squash kick. I fucking love that stuff. So real quick guys, I wanted to mention this. I ended up not getting the shoes that we talked about in the last vlog and I'm trying to include you guys as much as I can. So I wanted to tell you about why. So um, I had a bunch of you guys say that you thought the first pair of shoes I showed were really good. They were like the heels, they were so cute. I really did like them, but someone left a comment that said, I would want, when I got married, I would, something like I wanted, when I got married, I would want to have been my height because I wanted to be my actual height on my wedding day. And like, that made so much sense to me. I was like, that's so, that's so, like, for me personally, I do want to be my normal height. Like, I want to be looking up at Josh and have it be, like, normal, not different. And I want our pictures to reflect our actual height. So, I decided to bail on the heels, and I ended up getting flats instead. So, if, I will show you guys them. So, these are the heels that I ended up getting. Let's see if this will focus. Come on. All right, there we go. So, those are the shoes. And, let's see. And these are the bottoms of them. They're like blue. So I still think they're really cute. Let me know what you guys think. Oh yeah, guys, I also wanted to show you this. I ended up hanging it here. What do you think? I really like it. I'll show you guys from the whole room. So that's what the room looks like. That's what it looks like up there. I think it looks pretty good. I think it was a good spot for it. What's up, guys? It's Super Bowl Sunday, and I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, I'm really right. excited. Got my, my jersey on. And what are our Super Bowl snacks that, that we got going on here? Our Super Bowl snacks. We, we like realized that we should probably have some things to serve people. So we decided we should have, you know, some snacks since we're having people over. But we like don't we really having? have. We literally have what avocados that I'm just gonna eat those. Whatever. Um, we got we like thought of to put out cheese and then like wasabi peas, even though we can't even eat them because there's carbs in it. That's all we had. And then some almonds. <laughs> Yum, yum, yum. I feel pathetic, but we do have alcohol. 
beer and we got I'm gonna have bloody Mary. actually that's not even that impressive this is really lame <laughs> we totally forgot we forgot so we got dad's beer, like bringing over more stuff beer. but we didn't think to even have anything because we've been like I have a yeah. protein shake today. Because, I mean, look at our alcohol closet. It's pretty weak, too. No, it's not. It's What are you talking about pretty weak? Uh, look how much shit we have. Are you kidding me? We got a me? couple bottles. We got some. We got a lot of rum. Yeah. I'm going to take shots of 151 rum every touchdown. <laughs> You'll be dead. <laughs> That's the burns of shit out I, of your throat. I want to do it. I want to get, get crazy yeah. for the Super Bowl. So excited. Go Panthers. Woo! I'm gambling everything today. <laughs> Josh, what are your pregame thoughts? He's got to come out and play. He's got to come out strong. Pressure to Peyton Manning. Get the ball to Mr. Olsen there. How do you yeah. feel about it? Get him fired up. They're going to play all 60 minutes. Yeah, play, yeah don't <laughs> stop at halftime. God. That was crazy. Yeah, look at this play. Didn't even look at it. No. Oh, shoot. And he it for uh, oh. Oh. Awful way to start. <laughs> Are they going for it? They're going for it. Oh, oh, this is a mistake. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Watch Manuel Sanders. Yes, yeah, They're going for Let's it, go. dude. Let's go. They're gonna run oh. it. No way. Oh, Got no. Flag. Flag. They are trying to be so trippy. I don't like their new music. He used to like play piano. Actually, I don't know. I just don't like it now. It's so poppy. This was a good show. Wow, that's cool. That's, that's cool as hell. Where am I? Josh goes, trippy cells. <laughs> My dad made ribs, and I don't eat ribs. I don't like barbecue sauce, but I'm making spaghetti squash. Shadow. Oh, he's, he's so scared of everything. Ew, he's so slobbery. He just slobbered all over my hand. I think he's like having nervous slobbers. Again, is down. Josh got so upset. <laughs> I think he may have broke the new garbage can. But why? Did it fix? Is it working? Yeah. Oh, man. Good. Oh, come on. Are you okay? Josh is a little drunk. After the game, he and my dad started doing shots. Because it was a rough night. It really was. I hate you, Vaughn Miller. But I'm happy for Peyton. I guess. Whatever, Dude, what Cam Newton's so people? young. Yeah. He better retire, though. Yeah, I think he's going to. The refs were awful, but honestly, the Panthers just did not show up today. I've never seen them play so badly. No, Broncos defense is really good. They're really good. We, we played fairly well. It's just like... The Broncos' defense is not joking around. You know? Yeah, they're, they're good. The number one defense. For sure. Yeah, and we're we're happy because you know we we are from Denver, and normally when it's Broncos, we favor the Broncos. They're definitely our like second favorite team. And they won this time, but we'll win one <laughs> eventually. Obviously, Josh needs to go to bed, but so many of you guys sent us like tweets and stuff saying that you were thinking of Josh. So thank you guys for that. He will survive. Gonna we'll have a back. hangover tomorrow. Keep pounding. We'll be back. Yes. Good night. Maybe we'll be back. We'll be better next year. Yep. All right. Time to go to bed. Good night. Morning, guys. Oh, this is blurry as hell. There we go. Um, rough night last night. Honestly, rough night. Um, Josh like was so upset so he and my dad were doing shots I think it made him really sick but it was so weird he woke me up at 3 in the morning like like panicked and said that his mouth his teeth felt like they were gonna pop out and his mouth hurt and his jaw so I was like up googling it all and trying to get him medicine he was like really really in a lot of pain and had a headache and neck pain and it was just really weird so I was up like for a couple hours after that because I was so worried about him so 
So I didn't sleep much Ugh. and I'm really tired, but I have quite a bit to do today, so I gotta get in gear with these shakes. And this one's like really green. I think I put extra spinach in it, which is good. So I'm about to film a video in my room for the first time ever. I've never done that. Normally I film in the office or like, I guess the living room a few times, but I'm filming a clothing try on haul shop with me kind of thing. So I finished filming and I think it went pretty good in here. I actually might start filming in here sometimes. And I think it went pretty good. I think it went pretty good. Um, I think I might even start filming. Oh, come here, Mimi. Mipa. Come edit with me. <laughs> but I think I might start filming like fashion videos in here because I have a nice big open wall. But yes, I'm editing that now. Of course I go from all these like nice fashionable clothes that I just tried on for that video to my favorite sweatshirt from lookhuman.com. And it's not look Cuban. Everyone thinks it's look Cuban. It's look human, like a person. And this is like their oversized sweatshirt. They're so big and they're so comfortable. You're a ham. Look at you. You're extra hammy. Hammy whammy. Yeah, bubba. I love my cats like so much. Ah, that was a big scram. I got a few new things from Torrid in the mail and I want to get them out of the mailbox. Tonight is our Monday wing night. We get wings every Monday now. Um, Cause the place that we get them from has a good discount on Mondays and then we watch The Bachelor, which Josh just loves The Bachelor, right babe? <clears throat> totally. <laughs> and we watch Teen Mom OG. And oh, we have a new Hollywood medium with Tyler Henry. That's like our new favorite show too, it's cool. Josh gets to watch all these girly shows with me, but. Just gonna get the wings and chill. Has Lily been here all day? All afternoon? What? Oh, up on the thing. This is my friend Kristen's laptop. Josh was fixing it. And the cats have been laying on the case. They're so bad. Why do you think that you can just do whatever you want? Come here, homie. UPS just dropped off a couple packages and I have no idea what they are. I'm like, what is the, and what is this? Oh, you know what this is? I think this is actually our wedding invites or something to do with that. You guys, how exciting are these? These are the shoes I just showed you guys. I can't believe they're already here. These are blue by Betsy Johnson. Um, oh, how cute is that freaking box, girl? Um, but here are my wedding shoes. Oh my gosh, so cute. I love how sparkly they are. What do you guys think? You'll have to leave me a comment. I also got these cool stickers that we can put on the bottom that say I do. <laughs> and Josh got ones too that say me too. <laughs> so, oh my God, I'm so excited. Hopefully they fit. I think this tube thing that came is um, one of our signs that we ordered for the wedding. We got like a couple little signs. So Josh is trying to work with this unbelievably difficult packaging. <laughs> So this is the sign that came. I thought it was, the, I didn't think it was gonna be poster board. I thought it were a poster. Like it's like really thin. I thought it would be like somewhat sturdy. Like this can't even stand up. So I'm gonna have to ask them what, how they normally do this. I'm all bundled up to go get some buffalo wings. It's really cold out today. Is it? Uh, I think it's pretty cold. Or maybe I'm just like, I don't know. I felt like cold as shit when the guy came to the door. Dinner time. Come on. It's dinner time. Oh, you guys, I got this uh, skincare. I'm really upset because my, I'm like so scatterbrained. I start, I always start saying something and then start saying something else. Now I've done that like three times in a row. But anyway, my torrid package was not in the mailbox. I think it's probably with our apartment manager. Anyway, this did come. I have been checking out this new skincare brand. It's called Radha Beauty, and it's available on Amazon. It's very, very affordable. Has amazingly good ratings. This is not focusing, come on. So yeah, I have the, like one of their rose hip oils, and I've been using it, and it feels really good. Josh, you've tried that too, right? That oil that makes your face really soft, that when it's kind of yellow. Oh yeah. Didn't you really like that? Yeah. I've been using it like every night, and I love it. Made it soft like a baby's bottom. Oh, a baby's bottom. <laughs> mm, right. Wing night. We get such a good deal. We get these wings every Monday and it's like 20 bucks. 
such a good deal. And they have the world's best ranch dressing. Oh my God. I seriously like love ranch dressing so much and they sell like large gallon size things of their ranch. It's like 12 bucks and I think I'm gonna get some. So we're gonna start watching The Bachelor here soon. I'm just kind of really bummed out after last week. I was gonna make a talk Tuesday about it, but I feel like not enough people care about The Bachelor to want to watch it on my main channel. So I'm gonna talk about it here. I was really annoyed with the last episode of The Bachelor because I thought, so basically there's this girl, if you don't watch it, her name is Jubilee. Josh is on the phone, I'm gonna move so that I don't bother him. But um, I'll go in the bathroom for a second. No, that's weird. I'm so weird. No, so like this girl, Jubilee, is like really cool. She's cooler than like any other girl on the show in my opinion. A lot of people don't like her, I really do. She's just not a typical bachelor girl. Meaning, I mean, she has much more of an attitude. She was not a white, blonde, skinny girl. Well, actually she was very skinny, but I feel like there's, there, the Bachelor's like been really stereotypical in my opinion about who's on it and it's just stupid. But I was rooting for her big time because she was so different and she was really cool. And I like that like so many of the girls in the show are like such suck ups to this Ben dude, which I think he is just like a total dud. I mean, he seems like a nice guy, but he's so boring. Like, I don't get what they're all so, they're like, oh, I have to have this guy. And it's like, seems like they only care about his looks. I don't even know why I watch this show. I just think the drama is hilarious. Josh and I literally laugh out loud the whole thing. It's so funny. A bunch of the girls like freaked out because Jubilee, the girl um, that I liked, she started kind of having somewhat of an attitude back with Ben, like kind of being sarcastic, playing hard to get, which I think is great. And all girls should do that. Like, you know, make a man work for you and you shouldn't be sucking up to him. And all the girls were like, oh my God, oh my God. And like he's, she's like kind of standing up to Ben and like, oh. So I thought it was like so stupid. They like, none of the girls, they were all like, oh my God, I can't believe she would even cross Ben in any way. Like anyway, he actually took her off the show he uh whatever he ended it with her and it wasn't even like part of this he like did it abruptly and she it was really sad she was really sad and it was stupid as hell and i just think she's way too good for him anyway he's way too boring so that's my thought on the bachelors because i know a lot of you guys asked me to say what i think um i don't know if i even like anyone else that's left um i kind of like i don't remember her name but there's like these twins and one of the twins went home but i like the remaining twin <laughs> and Olivia's a nut fuck. I don't know, I, mean, I feel like the show just hires someone like her every season to like stir up the drama. Like they're like, oh, she's a little nuts. Let's, let's add her, you know, so. It's good for me. <laughs> Do you remember that kid? Bacon, it was on like Wife Swap. Bacon is good for me. You ain't gonna catch me in those little high heels. So we are headed to bed, but I wanna upload this vlog tonight. Um, but I wanted to give my thoughts on The Bachelor tonight, for those of you who are wondering. Um, stupid, stupid, stupid. What are your thoughts on The Bachelor? You made the right choices. By sending them home? By sending them Who did home. all that he send home? Leah. Oh, that Lee cra Leah crazy girl. Olivia. Yeah. <laughs> and he left Olivia like sitting on an island. It was, she was like crying and it was like rainy and he just went off on the boat with uh, the other chick. Who else went home? Someone else, too. Uh, Lauren. So you seem really into this show. Lauren H. Josh likes Lauren B. I like Lauren B. No, I like JoJo. I like JoJo, too. JoJo. And I kind of like jo the other girl, jo Kayla. I like Kayla, too. People's like watching this camera. 